Anthony Martial wants to leave Manchester United in the summer, according to reports. But where are these reports coming from? Are they reliable? And do you really think that Martial will be leaving Man United this summer? Let's get into it. First things first, want to apologise for the lack of videos in the last 10 days. I was out in Ghana on holiday. Severe lack of internet, couldn't bring you match reactions after the Man City game. What a game that was, and the Swansea win. But let's concentrate on the topic in hand. Now, the reports are coming from Mohamed Bouhafsi from RMC Sport in France. As we all know, Bouhafsi is an incredibly reliable journalist as far as Man United news goes, and especially Anthony Martial. He is saying that Martial has refused a contract extension offer from Manchester United already because he intends to leave in the summer. He's not happy at the amount of game time he's had at the club since Alexis Sanchez arrived in January and he wants to move on to a new challenge. Now, first things first from this report, I'm not too surprised. I mean, Martial, he's got 11 goals. We had 11 goals and 10 assists prior to Sanchez joining in the summer. But he's only played, the last 90 minutes he completed in the Premier League was against Newcastle back in February. And you can really understand his frustration. Take the Man City game of the weekend, for example. Huge match. Jose Mourinho starts Lukaku, Lingard and Sanchez up front. And Martial is left to be frustrated on the bench. And are we really surprised to hear about these stories? You know, Martial at 22, he is a potentially world-class player. I don't think he's reached that level yet. But if you look at this French squad that they've got at the moment, it's a golden generation and Martial is a key part of that. And United fans, we all love Martial, at least not for his goal and his debut against Liverpool, but just Martial's performances this season have been outstandingly good. His performance from the bench, one of the best substitutes in the whole league this year. He's always made a difference when he's came on and more often than not, he's made a difference when he started as well. And it's one of the great challenges you get at any big club when you've got the likes of Sanchez, Martial, Rashford, Lukaku, Lingard, Mata, so many attacking quality players. How do you keep them all happy? It seems that Mourinho has not been keeping Martial happy. Perhaps he goes on to say that Mourinho's relationship with Martial has been a bit cold and that that relationship and the fact that it's not so warm, a bit like when Fergie had Sheringham, York, Cole, Solskjaer, all four of them, and he managed to keep them all happy in a treble winning season. It doesn't sound like Mourinho has been doing that with Martial. And let's be honest, that again doesn't come as too much of a surprise because Mourinho is a cold manager. He doesn't always try to keep everybody happy. And by the sounds of it, Martial is a person who has been left out in the cold. Now, as I said, we cannot just dismiss Buhafsi because he is a very reliable journalist. Was really on top of the whole Martial to United story. He was the first journalist to actually break that news when it came out. We were all very confused saying, Martial, why are we going to go and sign Martial? Lo and behold, we did. Very on top of the whole Pogba story as well. So he's certainly reliable when it comes to United news and French players. What do you think about this? For me, Martial is a player you've absolutely got to keep hold of. If he was to leave in the summer, Barcelona, they'd be sniffing. Bayern Munich, Real Madrid, Chelsea, Man City, Liverpool, any team in the world would be happy to sign Anthony Martial. And that is when you know you have to hold on to a player. The guy's only 22, he's got so much more to grow as an individual. Yes, sometimes his attitude can come across sulky and frustrated, but the best players in the world do that. Alexis Sanchez does it week in, week out, and everyone praises him for it. Martial is a mint, top quality player, and United cannot let him go. Just like we've held on to David De Gea, when certainly he wanted to leave a couple seasons ago, but he's stayed and become the world's best goalkeeper at the club. Martial, that growth potential is the same as David De Gea. He can become one of the best attackers in world football, but we have to keep him at the club. Now, if you've already offered him a contract extension and he's refused it, then something has to change. But do you think that Martial will be leaving in the summer? Do you think United will actually let him go? Are we just worrying about nothing here? Or does perhaps his report make you a little bit nervous that maybe we could lose Martial in the summer? Let me know what you think in the comments below, as always. If you're watching this, drop a like on the video and subscribe to United People's TV. If you're new, back in town after a few weeks off, take it easy.